Hello world, this is Random Fix, and today we're going to be talking about the Xiaomi My 8 Lite, and this is going to be the 6 gig powerhouse that you've been looking for if you're on a budget, and you want a phone that can handle the games, the tasks, has a great speaker, and most of all, we're going to be covering important aspects of the phone, like does it have LTE coverage, does it work, how's the battery life, and is this something that you would buy. We're also going to check out some of the pictures on the phone which I'll be more than happy to show you and I'm also going to cover with you guys some of the features I wish Xiaomi will put into future models so let's go ahead and get this started. We're going to be starting off with the construction of the phone and this is completely stunning guys. The feel and look of this phone as you can see they did an amazing job on here. Everything's blended nice and well. The camera almost sits completely flush which is Great, it does come with a case which I'll show you guys a little bit later and we got everything that you could want for in a low budget 6 gig phone that's going to be able to handle all the applications and workload that you can throw at it. So let's go ahead and kick it off with talking about the camera because the camera on this thing is pretty sweet. We got a 20 megapixel selfie camera here. We got a dual AI system in the back. And the cameras back here are 12 and 5 megapixel set up here. And they do a really great job of getting portraits. You're able to shoot 4K at 30 frames per second or 60 frames per second at 1080, which is really great for videos and things such as this YouTube channel. This is what I use my phone for. And my phone has to be able to handle the workload. I'm a full-time realtor. So if you guys want to check out my real estate channel, I'll have a link below. So my phone really needs to handle a lot of applications, op opening lock boxes, sending out reports. So if this work phone is able to handle that kind of workload, guys, there's a reason I'm recommending it to you guys. Because just like you guys, I don't want to spend $2,000, $1,500, or $1,000 on the phone. And I want to get the most amount for my money. And this is going to be it, guys. So let's go ahead and move on to some of the other things about the phone that I think that you will like and are going to be interested in. The battery life on this is going to be a little enhanced to some of the other uh, Xiaomi products. This has a 3,350 milliamp battery, which gets me about six to seven hours of screen time. And it definitely gets me through the day. We got a micro USB-C type charger cable connection here, which is awesome because you can put it in any way. And it's going to go in. Put it upside down while you're driving in the dark. No more fiddling, fiddling around in the dark to get this in. So pretty cool feature. We no longer have a headphone jack. But it comes with a nice adapter. Which you just plug right in. Comes in the box and you're ready to go. And talking about money savings guys. This thing actually came with a case. And the case is pretty sweet. And we were talking about that camera earlier. And look what this actually does for that camera. With the case on there, we're almost completely flush. It's nice, sleek, and really does a great job of protecting the phone. And it came in the box, and I paid less than 270 on this. I'll have a link to this in the description box below. If you guys are looking for a fantastic deal, check it out. Talking about speed, we got the Snapdragon octa-core processor on this, which is absolutely stunning. And it's able to handle the workload. And this does have Android Oreo on here, which is 8.0. I went ahead and did the update. Didn't have any issues, which is fantastic. I don't know if we're going to be getting Android 1 on this. But I'm completely satisfied with the operating system, the battery life, and the features that it has. It works. So going now we're going to go into some of the things that I absolutely love. I've tried a couple of other phones that Xiaomi has like the A2, which does not have any expandable memory. This has 128 gigs of memory and it's expandable. So you can grab yourself a micro SD card, throw it in there, $30, memory's been expanded and you're ready to go and you can get years more use out of the phone. Speaking of things that I love guys, I love phones where I don't have to pay anything additional to tether and this came right out of the box easy to tether so every Xiaomi phone that I've bought so far this is my fourth one has been easy to tether I haven't had to download any applications pay my carrier anything extra so if you want a way around and never be blocked 
this is going to go ahead and open up that door for you without having to root your device. All right, guys, now we're going to talk about the one thing that I noticed about the phone, which I wish they had that they covered, and that's going to be an actual front LED or little flashlight here. So if you're recording and taking a selfie in low dark situation, that that won't be such a concern, but it's not available on this phone. So we almost got a 10 out of 10, guys. All right, guys. Well, thanks for checking out the video. I really hope the video helped you out. Please leave your comments, your questions below. If this is the first time you guys are visiting the channel, please consider subscribing by hitting that subscribe button right here and checking out that notification bell as well. So anytime I post videos that are aimed to save you time and money, that you guys will go ahead and get notified. If you found this video to be helpful, I'm going to have a link below to my other YouTube channel, which is Adam Does Real Estate. And in that channel, I cover all real estate related topics on how to save you money when you're buying a house, how to get the most money out of your house and things that you should know, how to be a better negotiator and how to spot a really talented realtor. And I can even help you find a realtor in your market for when you're ready. So check that out. And thank you. Hit the subscribe button and I really appreciate your continued support.